My name is Sandor Ironrup uh, from South Dakota, the Titan Lakota Oyate, the Lakota Nation. So, what is your uh, mission right here? In my mission here is to support the unified prayer for the preservation of this sacred land, this sacred site, this, this uh, holy, holy divine, you know, medicine that the Creator put here for indigenous people. This medicine here was, uh, it came, it went to the to the north, and the many tribes when the the government was suppressing our grandmas and grandpas, this medicine came, this medicine came in a way, in a holy way. And it helped our people, and it still does today, the spiritual balance that needs to happen within ourselves and within the world. So this medicine helped us to realize who we are, where we come from again, because the government colonization took place over there. And the same thing, same atrocities by the government, the system, the system suppressing us, trying to civilize us, is what they said. So this medicine gave us and supported our spiritual well-being, our identity, you know. So since that time, we weren't citizens in our own country until 1924. Yet our grandmas and grandpas, you know, roamed this, this territory, Lakota people, many other tribes, 500 and plus some tribes, who roamed the land, they live off the land. Then pretty soon they put us in, 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 in broken treaties, established treaties, 1851, 1868, Fort Laramie Treaty. Then they broke the treaties, and then they put us in, in, in little pieces of land called reservations. Up north, they, put, they call them reserves. So they start taking the land, 
taking the land from us. So this medicine came in a way and it supported our spiritual life. And so we, we want our identity back. We want our culture, our children, our generations to live with our language, our teachings. This medicine here, we all came together unified to support the preservation of our life, to support this medicine. So in 1994, Public Law 103-344, United States government recognized peyote for the Indian people in the United States. Different organizations are unifying all over, unifying to support this, the Rivadica nation here, because they use this medicine and many other tribes use this medicine. So we are all connected. Lakota said, Mitakwe Oyase, we're all related. This medicine, we're all related. So we have to unify in the prayer, put our mind, our similar the similar things that we think about that we want that so we put it together in a prayer for our generations what are you going to leave your generations today when the world is the way it is today the, the greed of these companies money 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 all the time money you can't you can't you can't live with this money you, like this you know you have to buy you you need a, something to eat grow it Grow it from the earth, the earth, bring it back the old ways to make it new again. Everybody needs to go and understand the indigenous perspectives. The caretakers of this, this continent, this turtle island, they have their way of bringing balance, the harmony, harmonic balance in the nature. And their, each tribe has their own teachings in a way to keep the balance here. So everybody, the world must know back to the balance. In Amakoche, the earth shakes, the earth knows, Mother Earth knows all the imbalance that happened, drilling, everything drilling, always want, want, take away the land from the people. We are, we are just, just of the land, we don't own the land, we don't, we belong to the land. <laughs> Thank you.